What's up, everybody? It's your boy Sparky TJ back again with another Pokey Talk episode. Well, Poke Talk Season 2, Episode 3. <clears throat> Today's topic is about everything, well, yeah, everything that we can think of about Generation 7 in terms of what do we look forward in Generation 7 in terms of, I guess, how many Pokemon is it, you know, is, is it going to be more Pokemon than Generation 6? Um, game wise, any type of new game mechanics, anime, um, if anything you can think of, put them down in the comments about Generation 7. First off, I want to talk, well, at first, I want to touch on since 2016, and you know, the um, what the uh, Pokemon X, Y, and Z, well, English dub, it's it's still, well, actually, you know, English dub, I, I don't I don't know, I think, I don't know when they're going to air the first episode of Pokemon X, Y, and Z. But I know there's somewhere like around episode 10 or something on the, you know, English, uh, Japanese subtitles where English sub of Pokemon X, Y, and Z, but they have yet to um, air the first episode of the dub. Ash already got seven badges. He still got to take on the last gym leader, then the Pokemon League, and whatever after that. So my thing is, since, you know, since we have, you know, Omega, no, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, for Generation Seven, I'm trying. I, I want to think. Um, if they're gonna actually go ahead and give us give us a Generation Seven, or give us a Pokemon Z, or a remake, another remake. Why should they? I mean, I don't know. I mean, a back to back remake. I don't, I don't see them doing that. But if they don't give us a Generation Seven, then they're gonna give us Pokemon Z. But I think since the anime is getting closer, you know, close to end. And, you know, you got other um, Pokemon, you know, you got new Pokemon games like uh, Pokemon Tournament. You have um, Pikachu Detective game. Oh, you have that. But, I mean, a main series. I want to believe that maybe the next month or so we get some kind of um, confirmation on a next generation or a main series Pokemon game. But I want to go... I want them to go, I, I want them to go into the realm of the next generation. Maybe. I don't know because I don't know. It's, it's because part of me is like I want to see more mega evolutions, more mega evolutions, which I do believe they're going to end up doing that. Because I mean, I think we have well, about 20, 25 Pokemon. I have not counted how many Pokemon that we have that are that have mega evolutions. But if they go the route of Pokemon Z or a new remake or whatever, then there's a chance they have more mega evolutions, which is awesome. If they don't and go into Pokemon Z, they can still have more mega evolutions. Possibly, especially if especially if that um that next region has other Pokemon for other regions in it, so they want to be like, oh, we just have generation Pokemon, you know, we just have generation seven Pokemon, and that it rather than have a mixture of all the all generation Pokemon into one game. So that's one thing. Mechanics, the main mechanics I want to see because you know we're working with a 3DS. I want them to bring back the mechanic from Heart Gold Soul Silver and uh, what's the other game that had the Pokemon walking behind you? I say no, no, actually yeah, that's the only one. Pokemon Heart Gold, actually no, Pokemon Yellow with Pikachu. Um, they have it where you know you have your starter Pokemon, well not starter, but the Pokemon that's in the front, first Pokemon in your party will be the, uh, the Pokemon that's walk behind you, which I would like to see that, especially in 3D or just on a 3D. Yes, just the light. That'd be pretty cool. Um. But I think I think it'd be like a lot of work, you know what I'm saying? Especially you know if it's like a big Pokemon and determining like, oh, this is a Pikachu, and then you have something like a a freaking Arceus or Arceus. Actually, that's actually called Arceus, Arceus, because I saw the movie, the Hoopa movie, which I I might do a little um a small review on it. But um, I would like to see that just this is kind of have the interaction to be running around on my bicycle. It actually like from my bicycle, the Pokemon disappears. But to be running around, walking around, and have a Pokemon sitting behind me, that's one mechanic I would like to see return. Everything else, probably, you know, I can't think of any other different mechanics. I mean, they could, uh, well, we might see more true battles and rotation battles again from Generation 5, I mean, Generation 4. Um, other than that, I can't think of any um, mechanics that they could actually introduce into the game to kind of, you know, just pick it up another level. But the one thing I like mainly about, you know, a potential Generation 7, it's just, I don't know, I think it's Pokemon design, but the other thing is, you got, well, it's like, cool, when, you, when you have something like Pokemon Showdown, that, oh, I can't buy the games now, but eventually I would. 
playing, you know, playing some like Pokemon Showdown allows me to be able to use these Pokemon and just be like, you know, it, you know, I can pick and choose. Well, no, no, I can look at I can look at the um, Generation Seven list of Pokemon. Let's say, for example, they go with like a hundred and ten. Let's go hundred and ten new Pokemon to add into the list. Now, wh the one thing I like is you know look at those Pokemon and pick and choose which ones are my favorites. Like, oh, I like this starter. I like this bird Pokemon, and so on and so forth. I like that. Create me a team on Showdown, and bam, it continues. You know, allows to play Pokemon a lot. Well, yeah, allows to play Pokemon um, a lot longer. You know what I'm saying? Um, you might also say, you know, when do we see Pokemon ever ending? Well, never know. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, the main series can end, but you can always create, like, spin off Pokemon games. So, you know, it's, so it's not like, oh, we have another 100 or so Pokemon back into the mix. So we have over a thousand Pokemon. You can see that the main series can end. But you can kind of, like, continue. With like spin off games and stuff like that, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, keep that going. Some people are going to most likely still buy it because we still love Pokemon at heart. You know, been around um, playing since Generation 1 and stuff like that. But, um, yeah, I think that's all I have to say. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. Catch you guys later. Deuces.